Irving City Council meets in the next hour, looming new concerns over a potential $44 million payout to the Toyota Music Factory developer. JD Miles live at City Hall with new questions over a clause in the agreement. JD? More Irving residents are speaking out in opposition to the city of Irving's agreement with the developer of the Toyota Music Factory. First, as we reported earlier this week, it was bar and restaurant leases that limited the amount of Tejano and hip hop music that could be played. Now, residents are learning about a clause in the agreement that makes it, it prevents any future city supported music venue from competing against it. As a longtime Irving realtor, Lisette Caraballo needs to be able to show off what her city has to offer. That's why she finds an obscure clause in the city's agreement with the Toyota Music Factory so troubling. This is very, very discouraging. This is, I'm not happy about this at all. The clause in the TMF's agreement with Irving prohibits the city from financing or even supporting any entertainment or multi use venue similar to the entertainment center located anywhere in the city. It's closing opportunities for the city to be able to open other entertainment venues, and we should. The city is growing. The no compete clause could upend plans to turn the former site of Texas Stadium into a large multi use development. That's one of the reasons Irving City Councilman Alan Meager opposes paying the developer. Of Toyota Music Factory, $44 million for completing the entertainment complex. I disagree with that because we want Irving to be a city that everybody comes to, a center of Texas, basically, a music industry. And we tried to do that by starting the music factory. And if we have our hands tied about future music venue developments, it's going to hurt the city. And the developer sent us this statement about the no compete clause. The Art Group City of Irving Agreement does have a no compete. It does not prevent construction of entertainment venues. It only prevents Art Group or the City of Irving from investing in or managing a similar entertainment center. The city is expected to decide soon on whether to approve that long term agreement and pay the developer the $44 million it's owed. Live in Irving, JD Miles, CBS 11 News.